beauties, I am Janine Z. Flanders and I am the Trendy Minimalist. This channel is for any woman who wants to own and embrace their femininity. Today's video is going to be how to style a pleated skirt. If you're interested in this type of content, please keep watching. Let's talk about the pleated skirt I have on. This skirt is coming from Francesca's. It's a beautiful, obviously gorgeously pleated skirt. Has a little um, lace, not overlay, but lace insert in the bottom of the skirt. And then it just flows on a slightly asymmetrical angle. So it's a lot of little details going on that makes it slightly different from your average pleated skirt. But overall, black pleated skirt. With that, I have on this black mock neck turtleneck. It's very cute, very simple. I've got it from Zara um, a few years back, honestly. But hey, I will link a mock turtleneck below because I'm sure I can find something really similar. This blazer came from Shein. It's a recent purchase. Um, it's an oversized blazer for me. I got it in a medium. I could have gotten it in a small and it probably would have still been slightly oversized because it's that much oversized. But I do like it because it makes it a little bit, I don't know, more free flowing. And so I like that oversized blazer. I added my Nine West knee high boots to them. They're in suede. And I really think that also added another layer of texture to the black look. And then for this bag, I have this Aldo quilted bag. It's a bag I talk about often. Really love it. And I think that completes my look. Am I missing anything? Yes, I am missing my gold hoops and I'm missing this gold ring. And that completes my outfit. Outfit number two is pretty simple. It's really kind of adding something that is very classic and kind of normal in a lot of people's wardrobe. And it's a striped shirt. This is a black and white, very thin sweater from H&M. I put it on with this wide belt to add a little bit more detail to the outfit. I have on the pleated skirt. And then I put on these black paint and pumps just for a little bit of shine. And then I added this Michael Kors clutch just as a little simple statement. This outfit for some reason made me feel very girly and I think it's just cause it's light. It's not really heavily layered or anything. It's just a simple, comfortable, swingy, flowy type of outfit. So now we're on to outfit number three. Outfit number three is very simple, but it has a little pop. So it's a really cute, fun, simple outfit. Let's get started. I have on this black tank top from H&M, very simple tank top, love it. Have on the pleated skirt again, and then I threw on my mango black blazer. If you watch my videos, I talk about mango blazers a lot because they are still, hands down, my favorite blazers. And then I have on these beautiful burgundy, uh, what is it, like textured burgundy suede boots. That is the thing that gives this outfit just a little bit something that you just don't see everywhere, basically. And then I have on the black bag, my black mango bag. I love this bag. It's a perfect little tote bag. And this completes my outfit. This makes up outfit number three. Now we're on to outfit number four. Outfit number four is just a simple cardigan outfit. I added my Target cardigan. I've talked about this prologue cardigan, I think, and I told you before, prologue is a luxury I guess line for Target they're a little bit higher price line but I got this cardigan from that line I absolutely love it I of course kept on the pleated skirt and then I just changed it up with my shoes I added my Calvin Klein leather pointed toe ankle boot just for a little touch of gold in the boot and just a little extra detail also I'm back with this bag this Aldo textured um, chevron quilted bag love this bag as you know i use it a lot and this was in my fall essentials video so if you need my fall essentials for some guidance this and that was in it and that makes up outfit number four okay so we're on to our final outfit and i absolutely love this outfit because it's comfortable guys it, this is so comfortable now if you watch my videos you know that i rewear my pieces and this is done on purpose because I think real people rewear their pieces. And I want you to be able to, if you pick up something, follow along with me and be able to wear it in multiple different ways. That explains this shirt. I did a video a while back on five ways to style a white shirt. And I used this shirt. It was from Ann Taylor Loft. And I love it. Love it. It's just a white button up 
to make it a little bit different, I tied this one. And then I added, of course, that pleated skirt again. I have on my H&M Chunky Boots, which is also in my Fall Essentials wardrobe. And because I'm casualing it down, I added this coach bag because it's a pretty casual, everyday bag. And that makes up this complete outfit. I hope this video was helpful to you. If you enjoyed this type of content, please thumbs up this video and subscribe. I make content all the time about fashion and femininity. And of course, if you are just stopping by my channel, I want to say welcome to my channel.